Hello and welcome to Tonic Studios. Tag us in your makes. We love to see what you're making. We're very sociable. Follow us to stay up to date with everything new at Tonic Studios. Find us on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram and YouTube. Stay up to date with Tonic Studios by subscribing to our mailing list. Never miss a video. Like, subscribe and hit that notification icon. Have you got a question for us crafters? Let us know in the comments. Subscribe to the Tonic Craft Kit and get 10% off every order. Every order! Have you got a big order? Pay in instalments using ClearPay, ShopPay and PayPal. Need to know when your favourite products are in stock? Click notify me when available and we let you know. Can't wait to get a die set? Click notify me when available, we'll let you know. Visit the Tonic Studios craft room for inspiration, information and tutorials all in one place. Looking for a freshly launched product? Head to the new launches tab on the Tonic Studios website. Welcome to Tonic Studios. Sorry, I need to do that louder, don't I? Because I'm with you. Hello. 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 Welcome to Tonic Studios. Hello, everybody. Welcome on in. It's craft a long time. It's craft a long time. I'm Karen in the hot seat. Oh no, we're doomed. No, is what we are. We no, are doomed. No, it'll be fine. Mm -hmm. Look at all these people that are already here. This is um. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm There's lots of oh, you here. We can't even go right back to the beginning <gasps> anymore. Oh no. So the first comment that I have, and I know there's more than this because I scrolled back before, but um, you've you've bumped it all off the top of the list. <laughs> Good morning, Mo from Orange Shire in Texas. Yes, we are in the Shire. Um, Don is joining us from California Hello. and is here with us. I'm working all day today, so I won't be able to do the craft long until Friday. I'll uh, watch and listen, but I won't chat. No problem, Anne. Hope no work problem. Is going well. Uh, Blue Moon is joining us from Michigan. 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 Regina is joining us from South Carolina. Welcome, Hi, Regina. Uh, Nicole is joining us from Perth in Western Australia. Good, Good evening. evening. <laughs> um, Gail is also joining us from Houston. Well done. Or Houston. Houston. <laughs> in which? <Yeah. laughs> um, Barbara is joining us. Just received my kit. Haven't had time to prepare there from oh, watching. No if, problem. No, I mean, you can do a little bit. You can mm -hmm. get your mousing done. Yep. You can get your paste spreading done. You can, you can, and you can start your cutting. Absolutely. 
Absolutely. Yeah. Uh, I've got a couple of Facebook users joining us as well from the group, so welcome to you guys. Hello, everyone. Carol is joining us, as is Isla. Hello, ladies. Uh, Gail is only watching today. Can't participate since the end of our fiscal year at work. All hands on deck. Oh, oh. no. That's very mean timing. Mm. Don't worry, though. You can rewind us and watch us back later. Absolutely. Neva is joining us, as is our lovely Raquel. Hi, Raquel. Um, so Karen is joining us from Renfrew in Scotland. Ooh, Welcome on nice. in. Nice. Kathy is here too, and Janelle. Uh, watching for a bit, need to have my car service. Oh, yeah. we don't like those. No, I've got two cars due for mm. MOT and service. I was just thinking I was going to service mine this year, and I forgot I had the MOT done, and I forgot to have a service done. I need to do an MOT. Sam's good for my car for me. Did he? Nice. Yeah. That's good. He's very good. <laughs> I used to have a mechanic who lived just down the road that did all my servicing and then he decided to go and live in the Caymans. I think that's very, very rude. rude. And now I actually have to pay for all of my servicing it's and shocking. my MITs because he used to do that too. Shocking. Shocking behaviour. Disgusting. Mm -hmm. uh, Renee disgusting. is joining us from Columbus in Ohio. Hello, Renee. Uh, Denise is joining us from Southern California. <gasps> These lovely places. I know, sunshine place. No, we're moaning already. The lack of sunshine. No, we're just, we're not going to say it. We moaned about the sunshine no. last week. I'm no. glad it's done. I'm glad it's done. It's over with. I don't want to see any more control over Do you take that back? No. Yes. No, no I'm Sophie not. is joining us. Hello, everyone. Hope you're well. I'm recovering from my daughter's hen do at the weekend. Oh, oh. I bet that was fun. Mm, messy. Messy. Yes, that mm. too. Uh, Neva saying my kit hasn't been mailed yet. Oh no, Neva! I'm sorry to read that. Can we? Yeah, I'd, yeah. Um, so last live before that, I did try and find her, but the live chat goes. Oh after, no! So I couldn't find her. And she never contacted me on email. Oh. Okay. And there's quite a few Nevas on the US oh, side, so I couldn't no. figure out who was who. There we go. Just yeah, in the US. I've got a message. Oh, there. good, good. Okay. I've got a message yeah. of Cam, Neva. Yeah. Uh, Kaz Crafty is here. Hi. Hi. Uh, Jane is looking forward to the tutorial on this kit. Um, Caroline is joining us. My favourite time of the day, watching your craft. Lots of fun and laughs. I don't know what you mean. Um, Not from me. Does anyone know if the sugar crystal glitter white was discontinued? Oh, I don't know if that's on the display oh, stage. Better not be. So that's one of our best settings. It better not be. Yeah, I don't no, think it's on the disco so. list. I'm pretty sure it's on the party list. I know we are. Stock is in general low, low. in card stock at the moment, but we are waiting Working on, on that. that. So, mm. yes. Uh, Caroline is joining us, as is Sylvia and Julia Versa from Michigan. Michigan. It's on the course. Yeah, it's a Thankfully, party. Thankfully, yes. Good, good. Joe is joining us. Finally get to do this live. Monster Child is finally in school. <laughs> oh, sure you oh Joe. Really. Yeah, um, with every shot. <laughs> Jane is joining us from Norfolk. Welcome on in. I've got a Facebook user saying craft kit is perfect for a day like today. Oh yeah, I yeah. could use a hot chocolate with some lovely little marshmallows in there. Yep. Um, we have a Facebook user joining us from Denmark. Welcome Hello. In. Um, early days editor. Hi, this is Gisella in Kent. Welcome Hi, Gisella. Um, we have Cassie on Twitch. Hi, Cassie. Welcome. Hello. Um, Anne is doing some coursework that is due in tomorrow at 12. Fortunately, it counts as scholarly activity, so I can do it in work time. Oh, I like that. Fabulous. Brilliant. I love it. Rhiannon is here as well from Australia. Welcome. Hello, Good Rhiannon. Good evening to you. Um, Jean. Jean or Jean? Jean. Jean. Yeah. Jean is joining us from Grove City in Ohio. Mm-hmm. Uh, Caroline is saying that her kit arrived yesterday. She's oh, us from lucky. Germany. lucky, lucky. Um, Cassie is saying, no work today. This is my first kit I've bought, so I'm looking for some oh. inspiration. Well, Ooh. Cassie, you're in for a treat today, then. Excellent. So we're going to be making one of the items that are on your uh, little pamphlet that comes in your kit box, Cassie. Exactly. So I have a Facebook user here, I'm guessing it's from the German group. So, uh, könnt ihr bitte die Untertitel auf Deutsch zu Verfügung stellen? Oh, okay. So, I think this person doesn't speak English. Doesn't speak English. And it's making it difficult for them. Mm -hmm. And they want some help. Thank you. Okay. 
So you on the title? Ah, oh, the subtitles, subtitles in German. Okay, so this is not going to help because probably you don't no. know what I'm saying, but it, <laughs> it's not possible for YouTube to subtitle us while we're live. Mm -hmm. It can only subtitle us after the fact because mm -hmm. it doesn't know what we're going to say. It's not that fast, unfortunately. Mm -hmm. So if you want the subtitled version, you will need to go onto YouTube after we've finished and it's had a chance to generate the subtitles. I hope that makes sense. Cam, would you be able to go on to Facebook, type that out, and it should translate it? Mm -hmm. As you go Google Translate. Yeah? yeah. Will you will you do that and mm -hmm. say for subtitles? Got that. Yeah. Exactly. Thank you, lovely. And I'm really sorry if I murdered any of the pronunciation of that joke. Oh, fair play. You got, uh, the, you got the gist though, didn't yeah, you? Yeah, I mean, I translated it and you, you got it. Uh-huh. I got a, what did I say I got? An A. I got an A in my GCSE at Germany. Ah, oh, well done. Um, Mary is joining us from New York. Welcome on in. Hello, Mary. Um, so Raquel is saying, it's nice someone is ready. I should have prepped also. It's such a cute project. Oh, oh. has Raquel not done her homework? Ta, ta, ta. <laughs> it's not really oh, here. Do you know what? If Raquel made one of mine, I'd be thrilled. Oh. <laughs> like being starstruck, you know? It oh, is my good. God. It just reminded me of a time that I was streaming and one of the content creators that I watched joined my stream and oh, said hello oh. and I was absolutely starstruck. I blushed. <laughs> I didn't have a word to say. I was just like, oh my god, hi. <laughs> It was Hello. terrible, <laughs> terrible. Uh, huh. In my other life, yes. Uh -huh. um, Laurie is joining us from Georgia. Hello. Um, oh, look, Neva said three of the Nevas are her. Autocorrect, you're changing my name as I was signing in. Oh, I hate autocorrect. Oh, I think Neva. autocorrect is possibly one of humanity's worst inventions. <laughs> it's it's terrible for people who can't spell. <laughs> yeah. <funny. laughs> yeah. For like Simon, who's so oh. bad at spelling. Do you know what? You can tell. Autocorrect can't figure out what it's saying. It can't figure out so it can't so put so it can't the them. words in. Yeah. 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 And you can tell when Simon has done his own posts on Facebook. Book? Yes. <laughs> With love. With all the And we go, oh Simon. There was, there was an email that he had said that I um, I think maybe I told you about it. I'm not gonna repeat it because it's not Please don't. But yeah, an inappropriate word that unfortunately got um spelt wrong mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. quite easily. Mm -hmm. It's yes. never ducking. Yes. <laughs> Never ducking. Um, Laurie said, I'm headed to work, so just listening today. No problem, Laurie. I'll catch you later, Laurie. Uh, Neva says, how do I reach out to Cam? I tend to go two hands <laughs> straight for the neck. <laughs> it's my preferred method, but, you know, uh, whichever <laughs> works for you. Yeah. Um, Cam has emailed. Uh, has, have you messaged Neva? I, I, or? I put my email address oh, in the There you stream, go. That if she's all three of the Nevas, I will uh, <laughs> email them. <laughs> Just, just email every Neva. Are you Neva? <laughs> Are you the Neva? <laughs> the Neva. Oh, dear. Um, Mary says, I have my kit, but I want to watch Karen and we'll try my hand at the kit later. Absolutely. Oh, the definitely. beauty of this is that it lives on forever mm -hmm. on the internet. Forever. Mm -hmm. So you can watch it back as you need. I know. I always say to my kids, because I hate having my photo taken, you know, <laughs> when I die, <laughs> it's fine. They just have to go back, yeah, just go back to YouTube. YouTube. Yeah. It's fine. Have oh, there she life. is. Maybe just drop in every now and again. Love you, Megan. <laughs> just so she knows. <laughs> oh, like I usually say, I don't have a favourite child. I don't like either of them that yeah. much. <laughs> yeah. um, right, so yeah, Julia is saying for subtitles, you have to watch after the line. Yeah. Exactly. And Neva is loving how closed captioning tries to interpret different Oh, things. good It very Lord. much struggles with us, especially <laughs> because... So number one, Welshisms. Welsh. They can't do mm -hmm. that. Number two, crafting has a lot of niche mm -hmm. words and phrases that yep. are not part of the standard language. Mm -hmm. So it's like, I have no idea what you mean. I'll just randomly insert this word here. <laughs> Sounds a bit like that. Yeah. <laughs> and yeah, then accents is just a problem. Yeah. Fun. Um, oh, oh. oh, it, it, oh. It, jumped. it jumped. It jumped. It jumped. Oh, okay. Nicole said happy mail today. Oh, nice. yay. Lois is joining us from Florida. Hi, Lois. 
Um, Facebook does live closed captions. So maybe, oh, I didn't oh. really think it did. Facebook oh. is very intelligent and oh. very clever if it can do this on the fly. Mm. Good luck. Um, <laughs> yep. Understanding me. Exactly, yeah. yeah. We have a Facebook user. So someone in one of the groups saying, first time watching. Welcome Hi. in. Lovely to have you with us. Raquel is apologising for not doing her homework. <laughs> I'm sure you've got plenty of other things to be doing with. So, um, Jessica is joining us from Puerto Rico. Hi, Jessica. Oh, why? <gasps> nice. <sighs> Sounds amazing. And there you go. Raquel has greeted you back. Oh, yeah. that was lovely. Oh, I love that you've done that, Cam. That's Thank so you, Cam. And she'll go. I like that. Uh, quick question: If Neva is still watching. Not going to give your email address out, but can you confirm whether or not it starts with an N or an E? Ah, on your email address for me, please, because there's two accounts. Okay, no problem. Oh, batteries are charged. Um, <laughs> and what Regina saying is the worst when you spell something so bad that autocorrect doesn't even recognize <laughs> it, and you have to go on Google to try and search the correct spelling. Yeah, yeah. been there, mm -hmm. and then you, um. You look at a word so much, you're like, I'm not actually sure that's the right word anymore. Exactly, and it can be the most simple word, like, there. And you're like, mm, yeah. E before I, I yeah. before E, I can't, I just can't do it anymore. <laughs> Terrible. Is it I before E? Except, except after C. C. Apart except from... from but I'd have to try and find that, that was so funny. Was except good. for my something neighbour Keith. Yeah, and then there was a whole load of other words. Oh, the, right. The the had, not I before E. Oh, yeah. no. Yeah. The had E before I. Very um, funny. And it's saying, how do you subtitle laughter? That's also mm. true. Quite often, it doesn't say laughter. It says music. Oh, it does music it? Music, it says music. So, I mean, I don't, know, I don't mm. think we're that musical. I don't, I don't think I, la I, I sang, but there you go. Um... Tracy is joining us. Hi, lovely ladies. Looking forward to having a crafty moment with you. Oh, oh thank you, Tracy. Come and join us. I mean, it'll be crafty. Yeah, maybe. Probably. Mm. Actually, it's all on you, so yeah. I'm sure it'll be fine. Wine Paper Stains is joining us from San Antonio in Texas. Oh, hello. Another in. Texan. Nice to see you. How many Texans? Like, if mm -hmm. we had, like, a pin. I know. I, I want had this. One. I want this map. Cameron, we need a map. We need a big map. And I want pins. I think it should be something places. that we do, like as we're welcoming everyone in, in the corner of the screen, and oh. a little dot lights up every time oh. someone says where they're from. Yes. That's what we need. We need what an add-on as part of our amazing live streaming service yeah. that does that. Restream, use other third parties? Maybe. We'll have a look into that. Because yeah. I think that'd be amazing. If you could just see like a little light flashes on every time someone says Fabulous. where they're from. Or That'll when we read it back, or when Blake presses the button. One of those things. Yeah, when we Blake do it, it's fine. Um, Jeanette is joining us from <laughs> Illinois. Nice. Hello, Jeanette. <laughs> so, Raquel is saying I can write in two languages, uh, but Google insists on me writing in. See, and that isn't even mm, in English. No. This is in, this is in Spanglish. Spanglish. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Simon did have an idea like that, but with who visited the site. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Yes. Although you can see that, can't you? Yeah, in so the back end of the store, you, know you can how see I've got like people... a TV to the right. So I've got a TV randomly put on the wall beside my desk because when we first moved into that office, Simon was just like, oh, cool office. Let's put a pot, uh, porthole into it and everything. Oh, I love um, the porthole. Yeah. But then he put the porthole in the wrong way. Yeah, he put it So in you the can lock him in, uh, lock him so, out instead. Yeah, so now I've also got a TV. So the other thing he wanted was to have it constantly showing and like people come off the website. Um, nice. People checking out and he just wanted to post mm -hmm. that and see it through um, Shopify. But um, I was just like, no. This is sorry. <laughs> uh, no, this, this is good. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, that's just too distracting. Yeah. I'd have to watch it all the time. That's and the that, problem. And, like, a little bit distracting when it's like a quiet day. And just, like, that's oh, <laughs> so nobody wants to come and see us today then. Okay. Right. Shall we run through the kit? So for anybody who hasn't had their kit yet or is still on the fence because it's still available until the 18th, this is what you are getting. Da, 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 da. What's in the box? What's, What's in the box? box? What's in the box? So you get your lovely little flyer. So that's one little card. And this is what we're going to be making today. 
Do you know what's funny? You know these extra spoons you've got? I found them in one of the pots on my desk. Did you? Yeah. You know that random pot of all of the die cuts that we never throw away? Yeah. They're in there. That one. Nice. Nice. Um, it's got your list of kit contents as well. Kit number. And marshmallow hugs. Tells you what kit it is. You can scan the little QR code as well and it should take you straight to our blog. I love how you put the word should in there. Should take you straight to our blog. And it takes you straight to our blog. Better? Better. Thank you. <laughs> more, more, more than likely, more than likely straight to our blog. In theory. <laughs> <laughs> so you've got your dies and your nice little marshmallow hugs sticker in there, which you can put on your binder or on the front of this or keep it or do whatever you want with it um we've got your dies you've got two sheets of dies in this kit you, you usually get a flyer as well of some description that may or may not have a discount for something which is why i just threw it underneath yeah no i don't think it does this time actually i think it's just a stamp club no it doesn't it's just an ad isn't it this yeah. time so i'm gonna go back in there so you've got your two sheets of dies um the one with little glue tabs which allows you to curve your uh, little cup mm -hmm. you've got your cup with a handle you've got your extra layer you've got your little poop emoji <laughs> or whipped cream or your, frosting your 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 cream for the top of your cup mm. it's wonderful you've got some nice little patterns here as well and some sentiments uh, a nice uh sentiment banner really mm. just goes across the front of the cap it's really really nice you've got some marshmallows in two sizes some steam for your cup you've got some nice drippy whipped cream that's, that's melted and all gone down the side of your cup and your little spoon as well so that's in your diet you've also got a stamp set i was going to say where are the stamps where, where oh eh ah there they are. You've got a stamp set. So you've got another pattern. So I'm just going to turn that around so you can see the pattern. You've got another pattern there, which you can stamp onto a cup. You've got two lovely sentiments as well. Sending a latte love, so you don't have to have a hot chocolate. And you've got marshmallow hugs. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. I'm going to pop that in there. It also comes with one this. of our zipped storage pouches now this is the it's um, called a pencil case size. it is I mean, called pencil case isn't it bigger than a pencil case. i would say so i mean we got a normal pen here <laughs> yes it is you know a good size <laughs> i like to use it for all of the little die cut pieces for a project yeah. if you are having to put your project away it's fab they're yeah, really really contained. good so you get one of those and you also get a pack of card blanks and envelopes and that was your free gift it was your one. bonus thank you exactly mm. on to the cardstock so we have i don't think i've stolen any of these <laughs> shall we check mm -hmm. so we have some silky sky mm -hmm. uh, which is our satin finish mirror card we have a chrome silver which is the shiny shiny mirror card we have a arctic blue <gasps> which is our classic card 216 gsm we have a bright white? white bright white i was thinking oh, i know colors. it's white but what is the word there's a word i know there's a word it's bright, bright. white and that's another 216 we have i don't know now we've listed this smooth as smooth mint. mint. It's not smooth mint. It's spring silver. Is it? <laughs> is this the spring silver one? Yeah, the smooth mint one is much greener. Oh, but there's man. been a whole confusion with smooth mint and spring yeah. silver. So it's yeah. that colour that you're getting. That one. This is our beautiful... Look at me looking at the list to see if I can see it. Blue Frost. And this is a pearlescent card, which is double-sided. Love. We have... It's not coral luster, it's coral pink! No, in that the 216. 
And we also have a sheet of coral lustre, which again is opalescent. So I haven't used any of those, have I? I've no, left a full that. kit. Look at me. I've got, I've got all my cut, cut pieces. Yep, that's it. That's all yep. Done. Right. So then we have a little bag of Nouveau as well. We have this uh, Bermuda pink embellishment mousse. I should turn it back. Should I see what you think? We have I've forgotten the name Shooting of it. Shooting stars. Shooting stars. Is it the silver one? Yeah. Yeah. Shooting stars glimmer paste, and that is fab. It's a clear paste with just silver glitter in it. It's amazing. Absolutely amazing. Now you will have an either or. Yes, you will. So we've got in this kit, we've got the three millimetre uh, Glacier Grey ribbon, but you could also have, sorry, alternatively have the nine millimetre ribbon. So it's an either or, either the three mil or the nine mil in those. So we'll pop that one there. You have a glue pen. I forgot about that. Mm. You have a white crystal drop, and that is just our simply white. And da, 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 da. Oh, love our favorite glue ever. Yeah. You've got to have your deluxe adhesive. We use it for so much. True story, I was doing some uh, extracurricular crafting at the weekend. You were. Had run out of deluxe at home, had to use the old standard glue that I used all the time. I absolutely hated it. It's not deluxe and I don't know how to use it anymore. It's too sticky, it stuck to everything, it was messy. I didn't like the nozzle. It was just a terrible time. <laughs> I had an awful time. <laughs> yeah, awful it was not time. a nice cozy crafting experience at no. all. A couple more quick hellos while we oh, are man. here. So, um, C. Hemsley is calling us. Uh, calling us? No, they're not. They're saying hello. <laughs> hello. Um, and Matt, be <laughs> great idea. It could certainly be useful of those who need help with their geography. That would also be, mm, yes. I need us. help with my geography. Us. That would help. Horrific. Matt. Horrific. Um, Suzanne is joining us. It's the first time here. Hello, Hi. everyone. From a very dull, wet, and dreary Leicester. Mm -hmm. It's very Welcome dull and wet and in. dreary here as well. Sarah is joining us over on Facebook. I'm here to watch. I'm still not a craft kit subscriber, but I'm here for the inspiration and the laughs. Cool. I'm sure you'll have plenty of at least one of those. Yes, laughs. <laughs> <laughs> um, who else have we got? So Jeanette is very excited for Thursday. Marked her calendar already. I don't know what you mean. Mm. Mm. Suzanne is loving the look of this set. It's um, fab. It really is. It's it one really is. of my favourites. It's one of the favourite kits we've done. Regina is saying that maybe we could have it do a flyover of each location. If it's home, <laughs> someone logs in, we can just go to that place. Fab. Maybe not. Um, we can have drones that stop everyone's homes that take a live picture whenever we tune in. Imagine I, that. I, I think that could be a privacy. <laughs> yeah, maybe. <laughs> How much fun would it be? That you just come out your door, go like this. <laughs> Hi, Tonic. Or the absolute shocker that's there when you look out your window and it's thing in the morning. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> really? Yeah. Yeah. Really? <laughs> Raquel is saying that the little sentiment bit reminds her of the American Airlines yes. you used to get as a kid whenever you travelled oh, yeah. back in the day. Back in the day. Nicole is needing the pencil case. Yes, you are. It's very good. I love it. Sue is joining us from Austin, Texas. Um, Mo is saying that she finally used the squishy sponges to dab glimmer oh, paste on. Well done, Mo. Did you? Fabulous. And Raquel is confirming this was a very generous kit for Nubra. It was. That grey bag of yeah. joy was loaded stuffed full oh not oh there he is i got him i got him um again. caroline says that she had the three mil ribbon she was very lucky with it and the glue is really good mm -hmm. i'm glad you like it mm -hmm. out for fun is joining us well good morning to you good morning uh oh renee is saying renee is saying oh. something about uh glimmer paste came more of a solid jelly oh oh could be that it got a bit warm in transit potentially mm -hmm. yeah a tiny bit of as raquel says distilled water you can reconstitute most of oh, yeah, the like, it is a thicker it paste. is it, i was gonna say you're not far off the because... normal texture yeah so that's mine it's not dry. I mean, I'm not going to stick my finger in there. Have we got but a, I have got a spatula. 
I have put a spatula. So yeah, it's not it's not dry. You can see that there. I am going to be using this actually, so I'll put some there. So it is so, quite a solid medium. Yeah. It's not runny or liquidy. No, not at all. And that is what I would expect. That is exactly what I would expect from uh, a glimmer paste. So I'd be happy with that. So this is what we are going to be making today. Bye, Janelle. Oh, we'll bye, Janelle. Later. Yeah, Apparently, catch you later. Um, Lulu is being left to watch to tell you to know how well you did. So uh, <laughs> I hope I do. Let's make okay. it good. Mm -hmm. Okay. Everyone, everyone all accounted for? Mm -hmm. Cool. Right, we are going to make this. Now, I have used one of our frames. You can use, this is one of the tailored frames. I'll show you which one it is in a moment. You can just put it flat on a card. Mm -hmm. You can use a box frame if you've got one, whatever you need to use. Um, I mean, just keep it on the flat card would be fine anyway. Be I'm good. sure Lulu will say it's a howling success. <laughs> <laughs> That's a oh. thing. Uh, Denise, I will come back to your question momentarily. Oh, go on, go on, go on, do it. Here in the US, the Precision Glue Press slash ah. Glue is being sold. Will Tonic Studios carry this? Not as far as I know. Currently, there are no plans to. Mm. I believe it is in discussion. But yes, oh. we have developed a glue press we have. in conjunction. We, have. we can talk about it now. So if you yeah. have questions, feel free. <laughs> I have confirmation that we're allowed to talk we're about allowed it. To talk about it. Okay, so for the um what bit did we do? So for this piece here, all I did, you can see how rough this is. I didn't want it all covered the same with the uh embellishment mousse when we come to that. So for uh, the glimmer paste piece because I just wanted it for the outlines of my marshmallows so I just put some on my mat just took a bit on a sponge and literally dabbed and, and rubbed it into my cardstock like this so I just get a bit of colour <laughs> you thinking I'm going to get that? No. Probably, after I dropped everything out the I mean this box. is not in your wheelhouse is it using Absolutely messy things? Absolutely not but what I mean is, I don't even use Nuvo that much. And even I can get something, you know, even though I don't use it. Do you know what I mean? So I just did that, get a bit more out because that's clearly not enough. And just either, if you want it, oh, look, if you want it fine now, you can just dab. Mm. That's nice. But that's all I did. I just popped a bit on there and let that dry. So that was my first piece. Rather than get another piece of cardstock, I'm just going to chop that off there. So Renee is saying that her glimmer paste is like a solid jelly. You can shake the jar and it all moves at once like a rubber ball. Yeah, that's definitely not right. Mm, that doesn't seem right. No. That does um, not seem right at all. If you do add a little bit of distilled water and, and see try it, and reconstitute yeah. it, if that doesn't work, then I would get in touch with customer service. Mm -hmm. Definitely. Will the spatulas be coming back into stock oh, soon? I hope oh, so. Yeah, we desperately need some as well. I think we've got one left, haven't we? I think this is it. Yeah, I this think is... I've got. I've stolen a couple and they're on oh, my yeah. desk for safekeeping. Oh, right, so they okay. don't walk. That's why we've only got one. Um, <laughs> they, are, they are on the party list, so they will be back good, good. soon. Right. So I'm going to. Hi, DC Oh no, poor happened? Regina didn't get the grey bag of joy. So she got all the oh, stuff, oh, but it was no. put into the pencil case. It wasn't actually in the lovely grey bag. Oh, oh. Weird. oh. You can't call it a grey bag of joy if there's no grey bag. Are we packing them down here? Uh, Regina is in the yeah, US. Yeah, but are we, you know, if we're packing them here and then? I no, no idea what's I believe happening. they're being. Uh, right. mm. Mm. They ran out of. Oh, I wonder. Apparently, Moe's was the same. Oh. But you've got everything. And Julie's. Yeah, they had all the items. It was just everything was in the pencil case rather than oh, in the weird. lovely grey bag. That's Very strange. <laughs> bag. I don't know who else to blame, so we're just going to go with Corey. Yeah, we're going to go with Corey. <laughs> the only one we know. Mm. Poor Corey. Okay, let's dry this off. Mm -hmm. Very essential step. Yes. Okay, next step, we're going to prepare this piece. So again, I am not a person that uses Nouveau at all. 
But I That's really liked true. that. Did you like that? I loved it. Cool. I like the texture on it. So yeah, yeah me too. Nice wallpaper. Mm. Yeah. I like it. it reminds me a bit of Wax On, Wax, wax off. off. Yeah. What's the cardstock? Flanders Blue. That's the one. <laughs> she knows. Uh, I'm just going to take a little bit out of my pot because, as we know, we don't use it straight from the pot because we don't want to contaminate what's in there. Let's close that back up. Oh, oh, oh no, my pot won't close. Oh no. Oh, will you do my pot? Yeah, well, Sylvia didn't get a grey bag. Alpha Fun didn't get a grey bag. Oh, they haven't got any grey bags Melissa left. Lisa didn't get a grey bag. Oh no. Denise didn't get a grey bag. Oh, I'm so sorry, guys. Hmm. Oh. Okay, so there's my spatula nice and clean. And for this one, I used this little fella. Now, I know you've had these in craft kits in the past. Yes. So even if you haven't purchased these, if you are a craft kit subscriber, I know you will have one of these. And they're so comfortable to hold because they just fit. They just fit in my hand really nicely. So all I did was I grabbed a bit of that. I came in from the end and I just went for it. And I just kept going and I did it quite quickly because I didn't want to get a dry line. Mm -hmm. Do you know what I mean? You pay attention, Ken, for when you do your, your room like this. <laughs> With your wallpaper. Yeah. But I because I didn't want that that sort of No, because it will dry very quickly because you've got such a thin, thin layer. Yeah. Yeah, so I did have to go. I did work quite quickly and I covered a whole A4 sheet and this is almost an A4 sheet. But it, it comes together really quickly and that is all you need. And that's my sheet done. So Sue Ta H now, this could be so many Sues. We have lots of Sues. Even Sue H's. Sue Hair. Could be Sue Hardman. I think of those as shade and brushes. brushes yes, yeah. they, they are very much like that. But when I like, refer um, to them, I do talk to them about the shape. So that we can differentiate between all of the brushes. We, that have, we have lots of brushes. So that is one done. And I mean, it's so quick to do. Just leave it to one side to dry. <laughs> I'm running, running out, out of room. One side. Yes, I'm running out of uh, drying space. So then I got this completely clean just by using a wet wipe and rubbing the embellishment was off you can take it to the sink and wash it but i did not do that because i'm lazy ah uh, it is our di hair see ah. you should have just said that soon we've been far easier yeah. um so mary thing it's a good demonstration of how sturdy the pencil case is that everything Absolutely. I'm so impressed that it yeah. all fit, yeah. to be fair. Oh, oh. buzz, buzz. <laughs> this is what happens when <laughs> I got really touching the desk. <laughs> Don't do that. <laughs> so you can get, there's still a bit of colour in this, but you can get that completely clean. Because that was the one I'd used. That's not, that wasn't a brand new one there. That was the one that I had used when I made my sample. So let's clean this up again. And I'm putting these straight in the bin because I will put something on that. Yeah, you don't want to do that. Nope. And let's have another clean. So, Mary is saying, Ooh. I've never used any of the Nouveau products. The colour on the card is lovely. It's the shine from the mousse or the card underneath. So, the mousse. This is a plain white, flat, mm -hmm. matte cardstock. It's probably. Feeling it, it's probably our 300. Yeah, could well be. I think it's our 300. So all of that shine is from the mousse. So the mousse, is it mica in an embellishment yeah. mousse? Yeah, there is. Okay, you're good? Yeah. So yeah, so. all of that shine on there is all from the mousse. Very lovely. But I wanted that patchy, oh, look at me. Oh, I no. wanted that patchy look to it. You know, I didn't want it. Oh no, last oh, one. I'm no. oh, sorry, you're not doing anything more messy no. today, so you're fine. No. We did talk about it the other day. It kind of looks a bit like marble. And we said mm. if you did some little lines of the glimmer mm. paste and kind of brushed through nice. them, would you end up with those nice grey, like the veining in marble? Illustrations. <gasps> Look at you with a big word. Wow. Or maybe mm. instead of that, the glimmer, uh, the grey. Uh, Oh, what are they called? The flakes. Oh, gilding flakes. Yeah, you could. Oh, with your glue nice pen. Nice with your glue pen. 
Oh should man, we should have, we should have. Okay, oh, well. so I have my piece uh, completely dry. So I'm going to pop that over here and let's start building our cups. Ah, uh, Anne is saying, I wonder if sprinkling of shimmer powder would be nice into the mousse, even though it isn't with the kit. It might would be nice. That you would probably nice. still have to add some water. Oh, no. I've just, I've just lost a marshmallow. Oh no! I, I got think, him. I got him. I don't think the mousse on its own would be wet enough to activate your shimmer powder. I think you would have to add yeah. a little spritz of water. Yeah, I think so. But just a little fine mist, probably. Mm. But yeah, that would look lovely as well. All right. So I can't remember what colours I did for what. I literally, when I recut this, I went a cup at a time, and I just cut all the pieces. So let's have a little look, shall we? Julia is saying that she loves watching the craft lungs as it encourages her to get out the messies and play. Mmm, good. Right, we got three of these, I love that much. Three. One more of those. There it is. There's my other one. And I've got some sentiments as well. Ready to go. I've got some. Can I, can I get my wings? You can. They match. Don't they do quite come on. Nice. Wing Commander. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Nicole says know. that your um, embellishment mousse sheet looks like pink silk. Oh, it, it does. does. It does. Mm. Very much so. And Neva says, according to the three second rule, that marshmallow is still good. <laughs> <laughs> right, so I cut all of my marshmallows on the back side of the cardstock because, as we all know, when you use is this yes so you can see you've got that weave texture there but when you turn it over it's much more flat it's not completely flat no nope. but it is much more flat and that's what i used for this so i used the the back side of the cardstock so that's those it's my six of those have i still got all of my marshmallows do you think Nicole says, um, I thought, oh, wow, look at that tea strainer. And then I realised it was a sentiment. <laughs> it could be. A tea strainer that says warm wind wishes. <laughs> it very much could be. Okay, right. And you need to keep this little bit of scrap that that came from. Where do we start? Shall we do the stamp in out of the way? I think that would be a good idea, don't you? Mama sent me a challenge. Oh. Mama says, what have you forgotten? Do you know what I've forgotten? Here, yeah, Mark. Yeah. The one here. Um, oh, Mama said, I found a difference fun. in the two pictures in the email. Oh, oh. Okay, so I took the picture that I posted onto Facebook off Dropbox, and I know there were some changes made, so I wonder if the one in, that went in the email was not the one that was uploaded oh. onto Dropbox. Oh, no. Oh no. Oh no. What have we missed? What did you post? So I posted, no, the cut list. Ah, Is right. that what you're referring to, Mo? Was it the cut list? I found a difference in the two pictures in the email. Mm. Karen, have you eaten any of the marshmallows? I have not. I would have. I would have. We were talking about marshmallows the other day. So oh. um, um, I. There was a, a point at home where I desperately needed something sweet mm -hmm. and I had no chocolate, I had no biscuits, I had no anything. The only thing I could find in the cupboard was a bag of marshmallows for Amelia's hot chocolates. I don't eat them, so, you know, she had the marshmallows. I got her something sweet. Absolutely desperate. So I um, got the marshmallows. But I'm going to get this. I'm going to... I don't know what's on that. Is this your makeup from the other day? No, it wouldn't have been on my desk. Oh. There's, I don't wear grey. No, you don't. <laughs> That's not your colour. So anyway, back to marshmallows. So uh, I thought I've got to have something sweet. So I won't this bag of marshmallows. So it, it, it proved to be quite stubborn. <laughs> Didn't want to open. It did, they're really mini marshmallows. Yeah. Impossible to open. And I'm like this, I'm going, you will open. <laughs> well, I will have to. <laughs> so I don't, I've just got scissors and go whoop, off the top. <laughs> yeah, but I was desperate at this point. And I'm in front of the cupboard going, nobody's going to know that I've opened this bag of marshmallows, you see. I was just going to have a handful and then go back and nobody'd be any the ways. So I 
<laughs> so pull this bag of marshmallows. Damn thing opens everywhere like this, ripped open in the centre. Marshmallows everywhere. Behind me. Everywhere. All over the floor. Oh God's sake. There's enough now for me to have a couple of sly marshmallows. The rest are all over the floor. So pick them up, chuck them in the bin. Are they even sly at this point? <laughs> Until I go to bed. So I've got to get dressed. I've got my underwear. Oh my god, what's that dog brought up you? Sticky marshmallows everywhere. In the bedroom. In the bedroom. And I'm like, oh crap. Disgusting. But we're telling, I think. <laughs> Definitely beyond the three second rule for those. <laughs> I, I'm like, I'm, I'm picking him up going, bloody dog. Much <laughs> 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 smaller than had fallen up my bra. That's oh, what I'm oh no. <laughs> Disgusting. Okay, and on that note, let's do some stamping. I'm just hoping, because this part of the sink pad's been down here for ages. It'll be fine. And it may be dry. As you know, we keep a piece of media grip in our stamp platform just for this reason. And this is Leo's magic technique. And I love it. I just and think I it's amazing. From someone else on Instagram many, many years oh, ago. Oh, but stamp. I haven't seen it, you see. So, um, no bag. Oh, here it is. Bag. In the bag. So, this is our power kit. This is the way we get our kit. We don't actually get a kit. There's someone else joining us. Oh yeah, exactly. On Facebook. Um, hello, not crafting, just watching. I'll craft later. I have a headache and I'm cold. Oh, oh no. no. I hope you feel better soon. Oh. Snug up in a blanket. Maybe make yourself a hot chocolate with some marshmallows in Definitely. it. Definitely. That's what you need. Or a coffee or a tea. Need. Whatever is your poison. So this is what I'm going to be using today. I'm going to put the stamp in. I mean, you don't need to stamp one. If you don't want to stamp one, that is absolutely fine. You can die cut one of the patterns and repeat it. It's entirely up to you. Or you can leave it plain and put the sentiment across the centre. So I don't think I'm at all straight there, am I? Never mind. It's fine. Doesn't make any difference. So you line up. Am I doing this rightly? You line up yep. and jump in the aperture from where you've cut your cup. So I'm going to pick that up. And then I'm going to take one of my little cups and I'm going to put him back in his little home there. And this is why we love Media Grip because it just hugs. It just stays there. The little die cut. It doesn't yeah. move. It doesn't slide. Because no. obviously the background of this is quite a smooth, it shiny is plastic. It is shiny. It is very shiny. So now I'm going to see if my clear mark has got any ink left in it. Let's have a little look, shall we? Yeah, you're good. Do you reckon? Yeah. Okay. Now you can clear emboss this. Mm -hmm. or you can just leave it to dry or you can dry it with a heat tool but what we're going for is the watermark effect really so I'm just going to press that down don't worry it's all getting covered I know I was just worried that you were going to have uh, impressions in your mirror oh, it'd be fine it's yeah, getting covered look oh, under yeah. there true right Yes. Yes. I might give it another going over, you know. Why not? Because I don't think that this has got an awful lot of ink in it. But Kathy is asking, does Media Grip also help stop the paper lifting? Absolutely yes. it does. This stuff is very, like if you put a piece of paper on here, it then doesn't yeah. move. Whereas obviously if I just, uh, it slides a lot on uh -huh. here and it doesn't. doesn't. <laughs> On here. So I'm just going to give it another another little press and see it and make sure it hasn't moved. Oh, look, you've uh, decorated yourself. Oh, yeah, I like to do that. And, and I've got my my lovely ring off my lovely daughter. Oh, she no, made me. Mo's stamping platform has gone hiding. Oh, nightmare. Are they, can they, are they on the web? Not for Mo, it's not. Not for Mo, it's not. Uh, I know, I know. I know. Sorry. <laughs> I was about to say stamping platform. They are back in stock. 
Birkenstock. Yeah, they're back in stock in the UK, but unfortunately, we are unable to sell them in the US and Canada. Penny is joining us from the US. I don't get the kit, but I love laughing along with you. Ah. Even though it's pretty early in the mm -hmm. US. Yes, it is. It is a very We're early. We're always astounded that you guys get up in time uh -huh. to watch this. Definitely. So there's my um, watermark effect on there. Can you see that, Cam? Because I yeah, can't see can much. See I yeah. love using clear mark like this. It's lovely, isn't it? So it just gives you the detail. You can clear emboss it if you want to, but there's absolutely no need. What I found was it gave me very little difference. So I had clear mark it, clear marked it and clear embossed it, but you couldn't tell, to be honest. So there is that. This can now go in the bin unless you want to make multiples. multiples. Take my stamp off there, put that over there. That's that finished with. That's all the stamping we are going to be doing today. Put that out of the way. Now, we are going to start with some layering. I'm just going to layer the little marshmallows out of the way because they can be drying then, I but think. Do you want to do one and pass the rest to me? Ooh. That would be nice. Since I'm sat here just looking pretty. Okay. Well, something like that. Really. <laughs> looking pretty. Right, so just take your marshmallow, pop a little bit. Do you know I'm done? How have I managed to do so much with the wrong glasses on? The penny saying that she often uses that tip when layering stamps as well. Yes. It's amazing, honestly. I like to do, when I'm die cutting and stamping a lot of the same thing, mm -hmm. I do all of my die cutting first because then I can Tetris those die cuts onto a piece of card yeah. and get the most out of them and then stamp. So I've just um, got that there. We have a Facebook user joining us saying, I've just popped in on my lunch break, a bit disappointed not to see poop emoji crafting. <laughs> it's coming. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe Karen will be making the five Christmas cards this month and we'll be promoting a lot of them. Be good fun. It's chocolate cream, that's all it is. Exactly, that's all it is. So there's your layered marshmallow and Leo's going to glue the rest. Thank you. Thank you very Any much. Any idea when precision tips were back in stock? Oh. Unfortunately not. We are desperate for we some are. of theirs. Definitely. There's those. Thank you. And there's those. And there's those. Okay, so I am going to have a look at what colours I've used. So this one has got one of those. It's got one of those. Because, like I say, I built this cup by cup. <laughs> and that one. So my first cup is this one here. And it is using these four pieces. Five pieces. <laughs> I need to lay up under there, don't I? Yeah, that's it. Uh, Julie, yes, we have had confirmation that we can talk about the glue press. If mm -hmm. you have any questions, oh, I have them over to us. Oh, yeah. I'll take a non precision if you need a precision as well. No, we're all right. I think, I think as long this as this is where all of our precision nibs are, I think so. Studio. I think so. Yeah, this is working as well. Because of the lights down here, we do find that they, they will block now and again under these lights. It's just the it's just warmer down here, isn't it? It's it not is. as temperature can, controlled as that would room. Which is a bit weird because these are LED lights that don't I know. give out any heat, but it just but feels they do. Warm, I don't care what anyone says, they definitely give out heat. Oh yeah, I, I oh. when I get in front of those. Yep. Same. Uh, good afternoon, Dee. Welcome on in. Good afternoon. What is the glue press? The glue press is a product that we have co-designed with My Sweet Petunia for dispensing glue. It's amazing. It is. We've been testing them for so long. How the Sue's haven't seen them, I don't know. Maybe they did. I'll probably tell us now. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, you you quite successfully hit it every time. Yeah. Because I think this yeah we haven't moved on afraid. Oh it's yeah. Before the dye tape, that was like one of the things you had oh, to keep finding. Oh, definitely. Because I was definitely doing before the dye. Yeah, you, you were. Life, you were that point, yeah, so. you were. Okay, so there's that layer. That's my front layer. That can be gluing and sticking, just there. So to make the curved cap what i did was i cut the layer piece and i cut 
the piece with the glue tabs. So this one gets curved a little bit. Have I got my, yes I have. This one gets curved a little bit, not much, just a little, just a little helping hand for that. Just give it a little bit of teasing into shape there. But I use the smaller one to stick it to. So it would give me the curve. And then this one can be flat to stick onto my back panel there on my uh, frame. And it'll just catch the bottom there as well. Only just on the bottom. So, Okay, Mo says, oh dear, which coral is the white on? I'm a bad student. I was busy chatting. <laughs> Were you talking in class, Mo? Mm. Uh, which coral is the white on? Where's the uh, white? I haven't put white on coral. No. Oh, are you on about the stamping, Mo? Uh, yes, I used the... If you're on about the stamping... I used the um Oh, it's a mousse. Oh. If you're talking about the mousse, it's just a piece of white card from mm -hmm. your stash. It is. Or I guess if you use a smaller piece of the white. That came Not really, there. because you need, really, it all depends. It. Yeah, the reason I've done that is for my back panel here. So what I realised when I made this project... I was just cutting merrily away and I'm like, oh, I need a piece for the back of my frame now. And I used another piece of coral. And you don't of course, I don't have yet. that, do I? So I thought instead of that, I'm going to mousse a piece and that's going to be the back of my frame. That's where that came into play. No, the gluing though. Oh. The gluing? Which coral is the white on? Oh, is it this? Not the white, it's the... That's blue frost. Blue frost. And it's so on... So that's on a 216, so it's on a classic. Yeah, there you go. So these are the... <laughs> Apparently Alexa just tried to answer you as well. Oh, well done. <laughs> there we go. Let's get some glue off my hand. Okay. So I've stuck one side on. I'm going to get my glue and glue the other side. I've lost my glue. No, I haven't. There he is. So we'll just add that to the tip there and hold him in place. Neva is very glad that she's watching this because she'd have been looking for a piece with slots to put the flaps into. Ah, oh, no, you, you just fold the flaps around. But it's always better to use it if you want them curved like this. to Because, I mean, they're just meant to be curved and glued on flat. But I just thought it's easier. I find it easier mm -hmm. if I've got like a finished piece that I can just glue Straight onto on. that. Yeah, same. So this one, it'll only just reach on the bottom. So it's, it's not holding by much, but you will be gluing the whole thing in place. So you'll be putting glue on the other side of this tab as well as the, um, what's the words I'm looking for? The whole back. Yes. So, piece. good morning to Deborah, who's joining us from apparently a wet and grey Florida. I don't oh, believe that. Oh, wow. No, I don't believe that at all. No. And Sarah's saying that her friend has a glue press and it's fab. Yes, it oh, is. Oh, she had one already. It. Wow. That's Blake good Blake has given Mo detention. <laughs> and uh, Anna says, don't worry about being a bad student, Mo. I was late. This is true. <laughs> Tardy point for Anna. <laughs> Tardy. <laughs> yeah. Funny. Okay. Come on, stick into place, please. Right. It's pearl, you see. And pearl doesn't like to stick it. It does not. No. So that is my first cup there glued into position. So what we're going to do is we're going to curve this. And that is going to go around there. And then we're going to add this panel on as well. So we're gluing so many onto a curved... <laughs> I didn't think it would work, I'll be honest with you. Now, this handle has got little score lines. You can move that so you can put that curved there and your handle can still be flat. So that is good. And we're covering all of this again. So we'll put some glue around the outside, around the outside of this. 
So Mo is going to stay after, she's going to clean the chalkboard. Oh nice, thank you Mo. Uh, Don Mo is here with us, welcome on Ah uh, hi. And we had very heavy rainfall last night in Nigeria. Wow. Um, See, now that doesn't sound to me like a place that's going to get heavy rainfall. No, it's really <laughs> um, Blake is also going to give Anna detention as well. There's a okay. lot of people in detention today. Yeah, I think so, I think so. And I mean, we do know that Blake is a hard taskmaster. Absolutely. Marina is also joining us from Germany. Welcome. Hi, Marina. Marina. You're not late. You're just fashionably on time. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, Nicole is saying you need a peg or three to hold them until the tabs dry. Yeah, oh, that yeah. would have been good. Been that would have been good. good. But it's okay. We can manage. We're just oh. going to go for it. We're just going to hold them. Kathy is saying, I've just ordered the media grip and the brushes bundle from the Septena office. Oh. Is there a media grip in Septena? Wow. Yes, Wow, Whoa. that is good. Right, I'm going to add this one. Oh, let's give this a curve as well. Oh, look, everything is in front of me and I just can't see it. I don't know what's going on today. I'm, I'm having one of them. Dropsy day. Oh, well. I haven't got time for that. Gabbing with Grammy saying, I never thought about making a picture with dyes. This is a wonderful idea and I can't wait to try and replicate it. So if you didn't want to use the kit colours, that would be fine as well. Mm -hmm. Because if this is for yourself or for somebody that you know, and you know the colours of their house, you could make this, because my kitchen is, my cupboards are red. My kitchen cupboards are red. They are. They are the IKEA red kitchen cupboards that everybody knows and loves. Um, and my walls are grey. So I would be making this in grey and red. Okay, I've got some hellos and some questions. Oh, so, come on then. Hello, everyone. Um, Karen Edwards is joining us from a very wet Clendodno. Oh, oh. Is that coming this way? Oh, no. Probably. Hello, Karen. Welcome on hey, in. Karen. Um, Regina is saying, who put Blake in charge of attention? I don't know. I think he put himself <laughs> in charge, honestly. <laughs> which is scary for us all. Uh, Rose is saying, this is so cute. It really is. It really, really is. I so love it. That there is what we are. I'll bring it back in shot while you're talking, I think. Teresa is saying, afternoon ladies, can you tell me a little about the monthly gifts, please? <gasps> well, well, what do you want to know? Do you, wanna do, specific? do you want to do a full screen and, and we can... Yeah. Monthly kits mm -hmm. are a box of joy delivered yes. to your house monthly. Yes. Curated products um, that will all work together. Mm -hmm. um, what else can we say about that? We them? have, oh, I don't know if we should say that now because then people, if they don't like the colours, they'll blame us. But we have yeah. a bit of an influence. <laughs> we do now. We didn't use to. We didn't we use to. Now. But yeah, we uh, we basically got in on that kit yeah. curation. We did. Thing? Yep. Yeah. So you don't um, want any blame if no one likes No, exactly. if, you, if you don't like the colours, then... It's certain you did not do that. Nothing no. to do with that. <laughs> um, so yeah, we try and make sure mm -hmm. with our lovely kit procurement team, otherwise known as Candice. Yeah. Um, we try she is that team. <laughs> she is that team. We try and make sure that they're going to work with the theme of the dye mm -hmm. and the stamp. Yeah, we do try. And they're all going to work nicely together. Yeah. Um, so you'll get a dice set, a stamp set mm -hmm. in every kit. Shall I bring them back in? Um, you'll always get a wallet of cardstock in yep. a lovely colour palette. So this is what you'll get. So you've got, oh, we can do this way, can't we? So you'll get your wallet of cardstock, which obviously you can see the colours because I've used every single one in this project i've done i i worked Stash really hard i worked really hard to, to fit everyone in uh so there's your wallet of cardstock you'll get another wallet with your die and stamp in so this is your die set that you can see here i'll, I'll actually pick it up because this is silly uh so you've got your dies there two sheets and you've got your stamp set as well um you'll get a little uh, you may have a grey bag of joy you may add them in something else because it sounds like they ran out of grey bags in the us it does sound like that. so in the uk this is a bit tatty now because it's been back and forth and back and forth but you get a grey bag of joy which is your bag of nouveau items 
and you'll always have a nice selection of bits and pieces in there. Could be glue in there, it could be tape, it could be anything as well. Um, sometimes you've got a ribbon, sometimes you'll get card blanks, which we have in this one. Sometimes you'll get a free gift as well, which we've got a lovely little pouch. Sometimes you get tools, you've had craft picks in yes, there before. Yes, we have. We've had brushes mm -hmm. and daubers. Yeah. I think we've had spatulas at I one think point. we've had spatulas yeah, as well. I think every so often we definitely put the, the deluxe piece of in there. Yeah. yeah. And we and get a binder every four kits or three kits one behind you. oh yes little binders yeah so we get binders as well so this is every how many kits camera three i believe yeah you have a little binder just like that to store your little dies and stamp wallet in <laughs> and it's already comes punched so it'll just go straight in there, like that Fabulous. So hopefully that's answered your questions. We should run through prices. Should I do that now? Here we go. Yeah, so, go on, then. You can buy kits as a one-off. Um, thank you. So you don't have to subscribe if you don't want to. So if you want a one-off kit, um, in the UK that's £34.99 and in the US it's $39.99. If you subscribe to our kits, so if you sign up for a recurring subscription, mm -hmm. you will not only get your kits obviously on repeat, but also you get a discount code to use on our website, which gets you 10% off everything else on our website a monthly subscription in the uk is 29 pounds 99 and it's 32 dollars 99 in the us or you can also pay quarterly which is 89 pounds 97 in the uk or 97 dollars 97 in the us so hopefully that has answered your questions about the kit but if you have any other specific questions please do let, let us, us know oh, did you mention that sometimes there are discount codes in Ooh. the kit as well there are indeed Yes, you can get, and sometimes we have kit subscriber events, which I remember one not that long ago where we oh, had, we had extra discounts, 30 percent off yeah, things. I think <gasps> we've had an extra. 20, I couldn't believe that. Yeah, they had uh, bundles that they could specifically get more off of. Yep. Yep. So yeah, being a kit subscriber is a big, big benefit over here. Yeah, a big deal. So, Lumen Genie has joined us. Hi. DCI Foot says, when is the glue press coming out? The demo with the crystal drops. Okay, so I've not seen that, but the glue press is available now. Oh, yes. Through My Sweet Petunia. Who did the crystal drop? Oh, I think it was My Sweet Petunia who did the crystal drop yes, one. Yeah, I think it might have been. The, yeah. Yeah. That's the one, wasn't it? Um, so, it is not currently available directly from Tonic. No. Don't know if it will be. That is a whole other discussion. Mm -hmm. But we, we are not, not part of yeah, exactly. yeah. nothing to do with us. nothing to do with us um all. melina is here as well welcome on in melina hi melina i see so mo got very excited because she got her bone folder and that's how she got lost in the craft oh right okay makes sense now it does it does um, i did not think of telling you that you needed the see you can tell i don't these don't do these very often can't you so i didn't tell you about the stamp platform i no. didn't tell you about the bone folder Oopsie. Oopsies. I'm not very good at this. I'm not very good at this crafting. Like. I don't need to be like in it to remember to use the thing. Yeah, maybe. Gabbing with Grammy asked, what did you use for the frame? Is it a die as well or is it canvas? It I missed the beginning. Okay. So what I have used, but you don't need to. So um, look, this is a return. This is straight out of the returns bin. Somebody sent it back. Because someone has had ours. Someone we, has had all of our frames. We had all four frames and they've all vanished. Yeah, mm -hmm. doing the right, uh, I have a feeling they're probably think. just in the wrong drawer or something. Maybe they've gone back be. in the wrong place. Must be. Um, so I went uh, searching for, because I, I, I couldn't believe it. I'm like, somebody's had our frames. And I was going around the building going, have you got my tailored frames? The queue is everywhere. <laughs> I was. Oh, I like, wanted to say, man, have you got any tailored frames in yet? And he's like, no. Okay, I'm going then. <laughs> and then I remembered that um, our lovely warehouse manager, Lauren, had given me a lot of um, returned items which have been opened and tried, obviously, and and 
and return back to us. Well, but why nobody would like this is just beyond me because I can't see why you wouldn't like this. So this is your tailored frame. Now this one is called Floating Breeze and it is number 3454 four in our decor range. So 3454E and it is called Floating Breeze. So you do have in here and this could be used for lots of things as well mm -hmm. and we forget about this don't we often very often so you've got a deboss panel and this will deboss pattern into your frame so you can see there you just pop it on after you've die cut it pop it back through with a deboss panel i wanted a plain frame yeah that's the only reason i i didn't do that but i just cut this four times Cut it four times and I you turn kind of... them down so that I, I use the full length for two of them for the sides. So you can see I've got a full length frame there. But for the top and bottom, I cut it down to 15 and a half centimetres, which is almost six inches there, probably around six inches. Mm -hmm. six inch mark so I cut myself two of those and then I put my frame together like this and this is what you get with a tailored frame you've got measurements on the back so you can see exactly what it, I mean you cover them when you stick the other yeah. one on is the only problem so you can't really see it there but you can see there's my there's my number five upside down and you can see you that's going to be five and a half, so the six is just here. Um, so, yeah, that's my tailored frame. And then you flip that over, you can put a piece of cardstock on the back of it. So we made this where... background just using the mousse from the Yes, kit. we did. You, with one of our brushes. One of our little brushes there. And I quickly just went over because I didn't want any drying lines in it. So I know I've got a lot of texture there but I didn't want a definite drying line yeah. in it. So just work really quickly, put some mousse out on your mat, work really, really quickly, round and round and round, and just get some colour on there. And that is what we're going to be trimming down a little bit later when we if finish our cups. If you are a Cricut crafter or you have an electronic cutting machine, mm -hmm. we do also have SVG files of the tailored frames we available do. on the UK website. And I'm pretty sure, Cam will correct me if I'm wrong, we don't have them on the US website. I don't exactly no. know why. Um, but you they can... don't. Uh, we're trying to work out how they work with their back end. Uh, oh, well. heck. But if you're yeah. a US customer, you can order them directly from the UK website. Yeah. Anyway, because they're a digital product. They and there's are. no physical product coming out. No. So you can you should there. be able to get those. Or if you don't want to make a frame, you can just buy a box frame from... Buy a box frame or just put them on a card front. Yep or anything like that but that is what i have used and i love it i love our tailored frames i think Me they're just too. so handy everyone's loving our kits on here oh, the, the chat about how much our kits are amazing love 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 yes um ms l is here with us as well hi hi uh, come on in um apparently you need an assistant karen i, I have a... yeah an assistant say. <laughs> that okay. would be me shall be we you. shall we do another cup right let's do our middle cup this time so that one has ooh, the same color on the back it's got this color on the front then we've got this one with the handle and it's our stamped one this time okay which means we need one winter wishes the blue one of those and our little wing pieces as well. I couldn't think of another way to call them the wing pieces. With <laughs> Is that what you call yeah. them? Right, okay. You said with the shallow tailored frames work. Yes. Yep. That's the only one yes, that's like currently still on the side. Oh, so it just means you're going to use that. One. I could have used that for this yeah. one. It wouldn't have made any difference to me at all. It was just, this was the one I put my hands on. Because, like I say, it was a return. And <laughs> I just dug it out of the returns box. So, Even the beveled ones, if you oh, yeah. think of those, would work. Obviously, Definitely. they're a slightly different shape, but yeah. they would also work. They just use a little bit more cardstock because yes. they're wider. 
that's all but yeah that is that would be absolutely fine okay so let's make our next cap so i'm gonna fold these again so these are our glue tabs i'm gonna take another one of these the reason i used the pearlescent card on the back pearlescent card is a little bit more difficult to stick to but it is stronger so it's not gonna it's much the, bend the, when you put that pressure on it yeah mm -hmm. so the 216 is a bit more flimsy i didn't want to go stick into a mirror so i thought what i would use is there two 250 250 mm, i think so i think so so we're going to give these just a little just a little loving a little little shaping little attention to get that to curve don also had a good tip if you don't have a bone folder just do your curving over the edge you do that don't you i do mm, i always do the bone For folder bigger things because i don't want to end up with that line mm -hmm. in the middle where you I'm do started. get it you do get it but i'm covering all of this you see so i'm not bothered that's true and this one as well i mean this is dried enough for me to work with nice from it where doesn't we take long it. no it around. doesn't it doesn't and we've got this one which is going to be our back in pieces so let's glue this again okay i did put all the lids on the glues well because done. i could i could feel them drying out <laughs> i was looking at them thinking that's not gonna be good for me <laughs> so raquel when she does her homework is going to remake this apparently they are a coffee family <gasps> and her boys would love this for their kitchen in different colors nice good are you telling me they don't love coral pink? <laughs> How dare they? How dare they? <laughs> so I'm just going to glue that down. And Mo has managed to catch up. Well ah, done, Mo. Well done, Mo. It was all our talking, it was. Yeah. That's, that's what helped you along. Ah, Anne uses an alcohol marker to curve the card. Oh, nice. That is, you, don't yeah. have that you don't have the square edge. Yeah. That's such a good idea. I know. I know. All these people with the good tips. I like it. So we need that ding. Hmm. A light bulb moment. Yeah. We don't have light bulb moments anymore. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. I will not have you cast an aspersions that I have ideas. Absolutely Thank you very not. much. How dare you? This is my second tab going on there. I put the card upside down in my hand and apply the bone folder like I'm applying butter. <laughs> nice. So thick that you can leave tooth marks in it. And... <laughs> Well, and there's that there and I'm just going to put a little bit just on the edge and that is going to catch there eventually because this oh you're gonna fold. thank you you're welcome I'm a good holder <laughs> but the thing is I can't do anything else until that's finished so you can't put your other layers together <laughs> I could do, but I like to stick them on in place because, um, okay, let's glue this onto here then. <laughs> it's not stuck yet. No. I did have to hold the last one a lot. Just put a little bit of glue on there because we are gluing onto Miri again. Oh, so I might need to put oh. that one too. No, it'd be fine. Um, it'll be fine. Apparently, Raquel's boys would be very confused by Coral Pink Card. <laughs> yeah. But Probably a more grungy version would be more yeah. Christine. I think for coffees, you definitely need some. Oh, I'm just picturing that coffee house vibe. Uh -huh. our dark wood. Yep. Our lovely barista aprons that we want. <laughs> yes, that's uh -huh. the one. You need to put the, the wood panel on your uh, frame as well, Raquel. And get the mousse out. Get the mousse out, definitely. Definitely. There we are. That's stuck into place, actually. It's not too bad. Neva has just ordered the tailored frames before they go away for good. Is there a way I can combine the order with the kit? Unfortunately, not kits. Oh, uh, no, sorry. Directly and very specifically. Yeah. But yeah, sadly, you can't combine. So this one, the one with the handle is just slightly smaller, so you get that nice little edge showing. I like so that. Gonna, yeah, me too. You can see the colours layered up. Yeah. Very cute. And of course, if you make one of these, you can always put a nice little sachet of something on the front I of the card. I think that would be lovely, like a little tea bag uh -huh. or a coffee bag, because you can get those. Yeah, you need coffee bags now, can't you? Uh, Murray's saying that to go with our coffee house picture, you need someone in a turtleneck snapping their fingers reading poetry. <laughs> but that really terrible, yeah, like uh, hipster poetry that nobody understands, not even the person who wrote it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. 
Exactly. Yeah. Is it? I, I I have this coffee house in I my mind. I can see it in my now. mind as well. Yeah. I think I've probably seen it on a film as well. To be fair, probably it's one of those like iconic yeah. scenes, isn't it? Yeah, definitely. Okay, so to finish this one off, I wanted to use the sentiment across the front. So I'm going to layer it, and I've just left a tiny, tiny little border of the light blue showing. Uh, sorry, the silky sky showing so i'm just mm. gonna bring it down slightly oops, a bit oops, of an oops, uppy downy a bit of an uppy downy you know we love an uppy downy so i'm just gonna bring it down ever so slightly so you've got that showing i mean if you wanted to you could cut another one and have it downy uppy <laughs> you can have it showing at the bottom as well but i didn't bother for this one because i thought well be fair, I've got enough layers of card on yeah, this. Yeah, don't add anymore. No, so I'm gonna just give that a little curve as well because it's gonna have to go across the front of the cup. And that goes onto there. So Raquel's eldest son is a musician. Yes. So he works brewing coffee at a posh coffee house during the day, so he fits the mold. Does oh. it look like that, Raquel? Is it one of those like dark painted dark wood the lights are barely on yeah. <laughs> yeah or is it one of those like industrial loft style places oh. nice is there naked brick oh you have to have naked brick yeah that has got to be a, a prerequisite of any coffee house oh posh coffee house absolutely. yeah there's one you know uh just by the 12 nights you know on that little no, toll gate yes there's now a posh coffee house at the end. Really? Did Don't you not me? know? No. Do you remember it used to be hairdressers? The old lady hairdressers. Right, I, I can imagine that down there for sure, yeah. but not a posh coffee house. Yeah, the, the old lady hairdressers. Mm. So um, the son closed the hairdressers and opened a posh coffee Turned house into a instead. Posh coffee house. I like it. Yeah, I can't even remember what it's called now. But yeah, they have um, really nice cakes as well. Which is nice. Nicole says, the best hot chocolate experience I ever had was after a day of skiing with oh. two ducks standing in the snow waiting for dropped crumbs oh. outside the cafe. Aww. Cute. I'm just going to pop these tiny little pieces on and you can see where they go. You've got the markings of your die. But you can see there and they'll just slot into place in between that. So this is how you know that this cup is actually a captain. It's Captain Cup. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> He's got his wings. Got his wings. <gasps> oh, man. Uh, Neva say I give up. What's a savings account? And then Nicole says I just direct debit my pay to Monic <laughs> each fortnight. <laughs> you may as well. You may as well. We do the same with the Popsy. Yeah, we do. We, we do. Understand. I know. I think I'm on a, I'm on a buy-in ban at the moment. Oh, man. Buy uh, yeah, I think I have to. Yeah, because the I Halloween keep... dresses are on Friday and I am having to sit on my hands on Friday because... Oh, do you, yeah, you're not going to any. Are three, there are three that are, I can't have for you dresses. Mm -hmm. So, Raquel says, I'll have to ask him, but I do know the chef who owns it was trained in France and makes patisserie. Oh, oh speaking man. my love language there, Raquel. Okay, so there's our second cup. And we're moving on to our third cup, which has got to be all of these pieces that are left. She said, hopefully, that she hasn't overcut or undercut. Yes, we are. This is perfect. Mm -hmm. So we've got our silky sky that we're going to curve. Pretty, pretty. Uh huh. So Neva thinks more of tea houses than coffee houses when she right. thinks of the UK, which is understandable. We are allegedly yeah. obsessed with tea. Yeah. Allegedly. But I think coffee has had more of a like a pop surgeons, I was isn't it? Say that word too. Well, <gasps> obviously, okay. in sync today. I think yeah. posh coffee has definitely had a yeah, yeah come more to the fore, really. isn't it? Oh, I do I like I do like a coffee, and I, I can't drink milk. So even though I'm not vegan, I am so impressed by all the vegan stuff that's out to the moment because it means I can have desserts and all sorts. I'm loving I'm loving the Just vegan. Don't be funny loving the I'm vegan. Bored quicker. Like something yeah. like I'm yeah. frustrated with I'm just like, what's that hard? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I think a tea shop and a coffee shop are a very different thing over here. So tea shops tend to be more Granny, tea and cake more mm. think like shabby chic or just mm -hmm. shabby in some cases um but it is more like a cake shop that serves <laughs> yes. tea yeah and it is more where your grandma would go mm -hmm. with her friends 
of an afternoon, whereas a coffee house is more where your trendy youngsters mm-hmm. are going to be. Yeah. Or it's, it's pasta. Trying to fit in. Get some, it's like, pasta for yeah, us. Cakes and pasties, I would say, for a, like, a tea shop. Yeah. 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 Yes. Yeah, but not even your nice posh cupcakes with lots of frosting. No, just like a slice of cake. Yes, a I slice of cake. sponge. I am really, really warm all of a sudden. Oh man, I'm, I think I'm having a. I think I'm having a moment, guys. Bear with me. You're all right. You're all right. You are okay. right. You're all right. Now you're all right. Um, I'm going to glue. Who is here? Queen. Oh, Good hi. To you. I am going to glue this last one in the position. So, I mean, I've just repeated the same thing in different colours. So it's a bit boring for you to see, but we'll play along. And has everyone caught up? I think so. Cool. I think we've talked <gasps> enough for everyone to caught there's up. There's a double-decker bus that does high tea in New York <gasps> City. So you get to sit on a bus, drink oh, tea. I've seen that. Yeah, I think I've seen that on something. It What's must it be... a TV show? I don't know. I'm thinking of, of a TikTok one. <laughs> I think Maybe. I've seen it on. I've seen it on social somewhere. Definitely. And then, the coolest oh. thing: floral papers would make bespoke chintz china for high tea or an album oh. on band thing. But yes, it would. Yes, it would. Panned paper for little teacups. Lush, oh, cute. Uh, not a double decker and not a tea house. But there's a place in Amsterdam where so. They got the canal. Uh-huh. Um, there is a canal boat that you Ooh. can that's catch it. I think they do pancakes and stuff. They have cats there. Oh, a cat canal boat. yeah, Aww. cute. So they can't escape. Yeah, because <laughs> they're surrounded by water. <laughs> <laughs> Nicole only uses coffee for crafting vintage backgrounds. <laughs> that's very funny. I'd have used tea for that, but yeah. Yeah. Um, oh, Anna has to go. Bye, Anna. Bye, Anna. Catch up later. That's absolutely fine. Yep. Uh, Raquel says she comes from a long line of coffee drinkers. My grandmother used to grow it in her home, roast it, and brew it herself. No. Wow, that's amazing. Oh, oh, I'm loving that. Absolutely loving that. I'm just yeah. holding this one into position. So remember that it only just catches there because we're using the, the smaller layer. I'm always saying I could never do a cooking show like this, so it's scrubbed dinner so bad. I'm having a blast though. <laughs> could you imagine the results you'd end up with if you tried to do a craft along but a cook along? Oh, man, I am so bad. So last night <laughs> for my tea. So I was making barbecue beef. Okay, so I had a lot of I, I bought a big joint of beef on Saturday, cooked mm-hmm. it for Sunday lunch. And there was absolutely loads left. So I thought, oh, well, we're going to have to do something with that, isn't it? So I'll bung a load of barbecue sauce in it and we'll have some barbecue beef nice. in rolls and just a couple of fries with it, you know? He had sweet potato and I had like salt and pepper fries or something. Um, so that's what I was doing. So I had the the beef and the lots of uh, barbecue sauce all in the saucepan and I had um, a, a, a nice ladle now you know and I'm, I'm stirring it a nice big spoon and I'm stirring it I turn away and the spoon falls so I catch the spoon <laughs> like this <laughs> I could have gone full screen why couldn't oh, I go full no. screen Oh no! So it's let me just set the scene. It's a new spoon that I haven't used before. Can I tell you it's going in the bin because it dropped again after that? It's all over the stove top. Oh my god! It was just, I'm just an absolute disaster. A disaster. Something as simple as reheating some barbecue sauce. I didn't even make it. I just reheated barbecue sauce, chucked the beef in. And washed it all most of it. Most of it. Okay, and but the best thing though, was it was the spoon. But the best thing was I got in from work yesterday and I was absolutely exhausted. I don't know what's wrong. I just cannot get to grips with getting up earlier. It's that third one I told you. It's, it's, the, the... it's the school hours that have changed, okay? And I'm up at six o'clock in the morning instead of seven. This is what has happened. So I cannot get back to sleep. So if I wake up, I wake up at four o'clock normally. 
I'll go to the toilet, I'll go back to the bed. It'll take me till about half past five to go back to sleep. And then I've got to get up at six o'clock. So, you know, it's not point in going back to sleep, is it? But before I was getting up at seven o'clock. So I would have an extra hour and that would be fine. I've, I've had enough sleep then. I have not had enough sleep. This is what happened. So I went home yesterday and I thought, oh, I'm not getting dressed. I'm going to chuck my nightie on. So I made tea in my nightie and I had this big barbecue sauce stain on it. Oh, my God. oh crap. Yeah. Oh, no. That's cooking with Karen. <laughs> yeah, Raquel wants a hidden camera in your kitchen. Oh, <laughs> Raquel, honestly, I am a disaster. I am absolutely... The marshmallows. The marshmallows. That was in the kitchen as well, because, you know, I was trying to hide them out of the cupboard. Um, <laughs> I'm just going to layer my um, blue, Arctic blue, Arctic blue layer onto my white. So we've got a little bit of definition of the colour there. Melina had um, tea at Harrods once. Oh, did you? Well, that's fancy. Oh, and they had a petit four trolley. Oh, wow. You definitely got to point your pinky at that one. Oh, Absolutely. definitely. And Suzanne collects vintage cups and saucers. Oh, do you? Um, she was going to use them for crafting, but she loves them so much that she just displays them oh, now. Oh, I don't blame you. I do not blame you at all. Everyone is now wanting cake mm. or scones or both. Oh, that'll do. We've had a brownie today, haven't we? Mm. Leo bought us brownies. But because we start at midday, we have to very strategically time our eating. <laughs> yeah. yeah, we do. Because it's lunchtime. Uh huh. But we are not stopping for lunch. So. We do not. Yeah, Sorry, we Cam. Down, uh, Did you? <laughs> we had a brownie. And it was delicious. <laughs> Raquel is picturing the dog looking at marshmallows, dipped in barbecue sauce, working his hair, waiting for the next round of madness. Yeah, yeah. yeah they do that. Um, so we've got like this um, electric um, slicing machine, so you know, like meat slicing machine. Mm. Um, so Ian sits on the edge of the table on a Sunday to slice the meat before we have lunch. And the dog. <laughs> Between his legs on the floor. Just in case anything falls. It does fall. Mm -hmm. It does. It does. So it's By like all accident. the all the crumbs that come off the edge of the the you know as you cut it and you got all the crumbs coming off. Like, so that I'm just here. To <laughs> yeah. Do it. Clean up an aisle three, please. <laughs> um, uh, as soon as he gets the box, you they hear it. They, they hear the box, mm -hmm. and they're they're there. Yeah. I'll, I'll just cheese. Like, we go in the fridge all the other times, not bothered, but they, they obviously can smell. Well, you've got to pay the cheese, cheese tax of new. Yes. You, you have to pay the cheese tax. So, yes. Uh, anyway, with everyone, because you've got a great bit. Uh -huh. It's all over the floor. Oh, yeah. The, the grating crumbs as uh -huh. well. Yeah. Maybe our doggo has those. Yeah. So, let's just curve all of these bits and we'll glue these together again. And it's almost time to assemble. Assemblage. Assemblage, indeed. So there's our blue, and we'll put the large cup on the top of this. So the cup is slightly smaller than this. So when Toby was designing it, first of all, I almost had him to change this so that this covered the back piece. And then I was like, nah, nah. <laughs> I want to see it I yeah. do want to see it I like the little, it the little tiny border is lovely yeah that's what I like so we've got a tiny border on this you can just see that blue showing yeah it was one of those oh, do I change it do I not you know mm. nah nah I like to see it oh Janice is here hi Janice hi Welcome Janice on. And I've got a Facebook user here saying, I used to love going to the shops on holiday in South Wales when I was a kid. They sold coffee beans or ground it for you. And they sold the fancy pots and cups. Oh, and the smells were amazing. Oh, beautiful. I can remember one of the times I went to visit my dad over in America. We went to, someone who's living in New Jersey. And he mm -hmm. lived just over the river, basically, from Manhattan. So it was only just in New nice. Jersey. Um, and there was a big supermarket there. And they had... You know, like the end of an aisle for us is like this yep. little end cap is like you know this wide it's yep. about double the width right but it was all just different flavored coffee beans oh. and you could just help yourself there was like a little bag and you could just serve yourself <gasps> like a pick and mix basically yeah, pick and mix coffee beans and they had a hazelnut one now i didn't oh. used to drink coffee back then i was still quite young and yeah. i hadn't acquired the taste but the smell of this hazelnut coffee it was just it made my nice. mouth water it was so delicious i love the smell of coffee 
just cannot drink it. Oh, I got into it for a while, while and, and then it started mm-hmm. making me ill and I can't drink yeah. it again. I do like a coffee. I like a nice oat milk latte is my favourite. I don't like a very strong, but I do like an oat milk latte. Just very, bad. very my, nice. My, uh, my friend, he left something over my house and he's like, I'll come over tomorrow and grab it off you first thing. He messed me going, oh, I'll go to Starbucks. Do you want anything? And I was about to reply back knock on the door he's there but uh, him and his wife they got starbucks so the guy didn't know what to get you so i got you lattes oh uh, thank you thank you oh. <laughs> okay. and eva doesn't drink it either so we just oh. and he does like branding of the yeah they're really and, huge and ones. i said to eva's like how do i like get through this <laughs> you got it so you just chuck a little chocolate powder in there oh uh, did you do I, that you had a mocha yeah, I chucked nice. loads of chocolate powder in there to get through it. Eva was like, I can't, I just cannot drink it. So I had to drink two grand uh, uh, <laughs> Nice. Well, you didn't have to. You could have left it. No, I can't, <laughs> I can't waste things that you have to bought it for me. So there's also oh, that. Oh, yeah. I cannot waste things. Okay, so this is at a bit of an odd angle you may notice. Let me get this glue off because I've just rubbed it all over there. Okay. What we are trying to do with this one is pop it on a corner so you can see oh there you can see that that will be reading the right way for you. I mean you could have it at an angle it wouldn't make any difference but I just thought as it's a uh, verse or die mm-hmm. and we can adjust where that sentiment is that is why I did very it like smart. that. You were obviously big braining it that day. Was I? Yeah. Wow, that's good of me, wasn't it? Okay, let's pop a piece of card in the back of our frame. Oh, do you know what I... Oh, Trim. I should see point. that. So we've got our frame. We've got our card stock for the back. And what I'm going to do is roughly measure it. I'm going to put a little pencil mark. No, I'm not. I'm going to put a big pen mark. <laughs> uh, yes, Neva. So TJ Maxx is TK Maxx over here. It is. Oh, I don't so know why they have... Different. Yeah. yeah. It's the same, but different. It is the same. I different. just thought she pressed the J instead of the no, K on the keyboard. No, no it's right TJ there. Maxx. Okay. Maybe it was a misspelling when you were... Yeah. Yeah, from the past. Okay, this is going to be fun. I need this big trimmer. Oh. Uh-oh. We all know we should use the rotary oh, for these. Back then. Oh, sorry, I've got this one now. Oh, okay. I'm just killing everything else. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not doing anything. Yes. I like to do that. Okay. So I know that here's my mark here, mm-hmm. and I know I need to be slightly in from there. So let's chomp that off there. And the other one, where's my mark? Oh, I'm not going to see him. Like, yes, I am. Just Short person problems? Yeah, <laughs> it's so high, I can't see it. Uh, a little bit more, I think. There you go. That'll do me. Good nice. morning, Crafty Ladybug. Welcome home here. Good morning to you. I found out why the names are different. Oh, okay. okay. Please enlighten us. We need some so, education today. In 1976, TJ Maxx was founded in Massachusetts. 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 Mas- Mas- yeah. <laughs> that as well. Uh, uh, the first international store opened in Bristol uh, in 1994. Okay. The company modified the name to TK Maxx to avoid confusion with the established British retail chain TJ Hughes. Oh, okay. Uh, okay. I see. Yeah. That's why. I think we had a TJ Hughes close somewhere. Yeah, yeah, I have. Raquel is wondering how you spell Massachusetts. Massachusetts. I, I read it. I was like, that is not how you say it. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. That is I, I can't funny. get my, my tongue around that. Just Mas- like Massachusetts. 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 Chew. 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 Set. Set. Massachusetts. No! <laughs> no! It's it's like like TV show. Is this a bit like Michigan? <laughs> yeah, all, over all over again. Yeah, I don't know. Mi- Michigan, Michigan, I can say. There you go. You just can't say Massachusetts. <laughs> no, he <laughs> <we> cannot. <laughs> no, right. Birmingham, I couldn't say forever. 
Oh, no, I think it was only until I was living in Stoke for, uh, for a year that I finally was able to save everything properly. So funny. Before I had to really break it down <laughs> to say it to anyone. Birmingham. There was one time I was, I was getting back to Stoke because I just moved there. And so I was trying to say to the, uh, the train conductor, I was like, right, I'm going to Birmingham. And I was like, and that was like, I can't say the words. Oh, it's fair. It's fair. I, I can't say it. What, what is it? <laughs> <laughs> Bless you. Oh, you all couldn't say Aww. it. Oh. Welcome on in, Cammy. You haven't missed us. And um, Cammy's kit arrived yesterday. This is very oh, early. Oh, fabulous. Go. So I have got an overhang. So I'm just going to snippity snip that off there. Not very well. Are you all right? <laughs> Sophie is saying, I love having this as sort of a podcast whilst working away and being crafty. <laughs> Definitely put me in the mood for a hot chocolate. Could you imagine a podcast? Oh, it would be like I five think, hours of the most random you know conversation. What? I think a podcast would be hilarious. I'm, I'm all for that. Crafty podcast. The problem is, crafting is a visual thing. Yeah, it is. But I would love to do a podcast. I'm, I'm all over that, guys. I am all over that. Janelle is back. She's in the car waiting room, and Yay. Lulu is giving me five stars. Yay! Thank you, Lulu. Okay, I've put my uh, piece of card on the back there, and now it's time to place my cups. So I'm going straight up for the first one. I think. Yeah. Yeah. So let's pop them in and see where we want to start. So I've got. Oh, which way did I do that one? I did that one there. Straight, straight. Mm, I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm going to go rogue, you know. I might yeah. put the handle in this one. Oh. oh. Mm, 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 mm. I don't know where I want to put them now. Oh, no. Do you know, I'm so indecisive. I was like this last time. don't know where I want them. Like that, like that, like that. Should I just copy that? It'll take all the thinking up there. Because, you know... Okay, let's come down a smidge there. Are we happy with that? Nice. I'll do. Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's get glue in then. So we're going to put our first one down. So this is what I mean about we've got plenty of room to glue because we're going to glue the tabs and we're going to add glue to all of this as well. Plenty of surface area. Plenty of area to glue there. So this is. Nice and flat. It stayed quite flat as well. Not too bad at all. So we'll start off around here. <laughs> Rough this one. Approximately here? Approximately. <laughs> so, uh, down. Cam, um, who did the phonetics for you? Mo has done yeah, some. Oh, let me see. Massachusetts. Oh, I love it. Massachusetts. Yay! Yay! Thank you, Mo. Thank you. <laughs> it's very funny. Very, very funny. Okay. Next, we've got our winter wishes, and he's going to go at an angle there. A bit jaunty, like. Oh, absolutely. You know how jaunty I am. Absolutely. <laughs> Not jaunty Not at, all. at all. What are the measurements of the box on the outside? That is a very good question. Okay. Jen. Would you like to go over those? Mm-hmm. So it was 26, which is the full length of the die on the sides. Die, yes. Die. So for your floating breeze tailored frames, the full length of this is 26. Is it 26 generic increments or is it centimetres? Centimetre. <laughs> That's very funny. Well, it's not 26 inches, is it? Well, I don't know. <laughs> We've all been lying to about sizes all our lives. Um, so the full length of this cuts 26 centimetres. So for your two sides, you leave it a full length. For the top and the bottom, you trim at 15 and a half centimetres. Which is approximately and six inches. It does actually have yeah, increments on it. The little debossed increments on here so you can trim it. Nibbity schnip. Schnibbity schnip. Super Indeed. says, I worked in a bookshop many years ago. I had the phone to say an aromatherapy book order had arrived. It came out as aromatherapy, <laughs> amor therapy, and goodness knows what until I had to say, your book's here. <laughs> Sorry. 
And it was before the time when you could cancel a voice of a male. Oh, like, no. Again. So, yeah, That's back in those days. Mo is asking me to get out of detention now. I don't know, Mo. Have you caught up? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so my last cup is going in. So just be careful as you pop them in because obviously all of your glue is on the back there. Make sure you've got it in position and then place it down. You can hold down from the inside then. If you need any extra help in gluing it, just pop your bone folder in. And that's got that nice flat edge that you can push all of your areas of cardstock down. So um, I have me glued. Hi, Vicky. Look at me crafting. <gasps> I know. Are you <laughs> Everyone else is. She <laughs> loves the cut and thinks this could be very useful throughout the year yes definitely okay so for my uh my little captain's wings for the side here i'm just going to put a little bit of glue and all it's going to need is these ends here because it's all hanging over the center nice. so we'll put him there i think Go. Oh, I think okay. we've tempted someone into buying the kit. So I don't know who it is. Have we? Facebook user. Oh, I Facebook think user. I might have to have this. I think you oh, might have to as well. I love it. Honestly, now it is one of my most favourites. Um, don't forget if you do subscribe, if there is a kit that you're not that fussed on, you can skip as well. So you still get your ten percent off all other purchases from our shop. And if you subscribe, your kit is kind of put away for you yeah. every month. Yeah, it is. We do have some kits that sell out very quickly. We do. And the one-offs are... Very limited. Very limited. They're basically the extras. Yeah. Um, and so we can't always guarantee there are going to be no. many of them available. If you want to be sure that a kit is reserved for you, subscribing is the way to go. Mm -hmm. well, let's pop these on the corner. I'm going to do all my drops Hi, at Steph. the end. Hi, Steph. Hi, Steph. How are you doing? It is a lovely kit, though. I like the colours as well. Yeah, I don't think do we too. had... Oh, did we have that much influence on these? I think we were I, given options, weren't yes, we? Yeah, because we were a little bit low on cardstock, I think, mm. if I remember rightly, for this one. I think this was before the cardstock the order, card came order came in. Yeah. Yeah, Which I know sounds ridiculous because obviously that cardstock order came in months ago. Oh, but we put the cardstock were... away oh. six months ago. Oh, and the rest. I think it was longer than that. It was ages and ages ago. We uh, we looked at this. Okay, pull one in the bottom there, and a full one in the bottom there, and we'll take these foam pads off. Okay. Yeah, there's a whole conversation about Mickey Martin, and I'm very confused what's going on. Mm, she bangs. She bangs. She's got the recipes. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay, I'm putting one just there, one here, just to finish. I did cut loads of these, and I was going to go around the whole frame, and it didn't. It didn't finish right. My mm. frame was the wrong size, so I changed my plan. I should have brought down the glue gun. I did say I was going to bring the glue gun and I didn't pick it up. We did. Never mind. So I am going to put a use bow. I will use some tea. Even though Mammy Ali says we can't tape anything. I'll put a little square of tape on there, I think. So that's going to be the easiest way to get it off, isn't it? Mm hmm and then all we need to do is our finishing touches, which are our marshmallows. Little marshmallows. Little marshmallows. Steph is loving the spoons as well. Oh, oh the I spoons are the very spoons. cute. I love the spoons. Okay, so I did, what did I do? I did a normal bow for that one. So that's the nine mil. So let's get the nine mil tape. Bow, ribbon, ribbon. whatever it is. This stuff. This stuff. <laughs> and I just did a normal bow for this one. Bunny ears. Bunny ears. Look at Lush. There we go. It's all about the faffin. It is. All about the faffin. Let's get. Apparently, since we have two of these now, we should give one away. Oh, we could do. If anybody wants one. 
Would you want one? Don't forget to put the barbecue sauce on the marshmallow. <laughs> I wouldn't dream of it. Outside up to the centre. And outside up to the centre. And we get up. Mary's going to have to customise her frame. She has a wonderful yeah. idea. It will be a surprise. Oh, nice. Okay, now if you've got the three mil ribbon, this is not a problem either. Because you could just do a double bow. So I'm going to hold that in place. I'm going to go around and around and around and around. And then I'm going to cut. About that much. Okay. And then I'm going to go. Stay in place. I'm going to go through my fingers. I'm going to bring it back through there. And then I'm going to feed it through, which ties my knot. Okay, then once you've got them stuck on your fingers, <laughs> like I have, <laughs> you just take them off and your bow is ready to go. So you've got your knot in the centre there, oh that way is nicer, and you've got your double loops. My other one was nicer than this. Apparently this is giving Vicky flashbacks to the NEC. NEC, they, they videoed me doing this because... Nobody could work out how to do the double loop. Mm. And Christine videoed it, I think. Yeah, this isn't this isn't sitting very nice. Where's my other one? I just did one and it was lovely. And I've lost it. I'm really lost it, actually. <laughs> we haven't talked about your gigantic sippy cup, have we? <laughs> well, yesterday we had fun with the gigantic sippy cup. Mm, fun. I'm sure we always call it fun. <laughs> So we were filming the showcase reveal. We were, and I um, went to get <laughs> went to get the last uh, sample from here, and I thought, oh, I'm really lucky I didn't knock that over then. And then I looked at the screen. Sippy cup in shot for the entire video. All the whole thing here, like about there. So that's why I thought, oh, I, I have to make sure I don't hit that over. Oh. So we filmed it again. <laughs> no, <laughs> we did. So here's my double bow. This one isn't sitting nicely and I don't know why. Let's tighten him up a bit more, is it? See if that'll do it. If I pull him now, he's gonna he's going to tighten the wrong way, isn't he? He's gonna tighten my loops. There we are, it's not too bad. Oh, it's not so bad. Okay. Just needed to tighten him. So okay. I was saying I went camping once in autumn. Autumn, by the way, not fall. Autumn. <laughs> with friends and I was wearing hiking boots. Uh, my BFF caught her marshmallow on fire and started flinging her stick. Her marshmallow <laughs> flew off and it landed all in my laces. Oh, no. <laughs> Why does that happen? Because that's what you automatically do when something is on fire. Like, so ah. funny. So funny. Okay, let's get these marshmallows stuck in place, shall we? So we'll have some big foam pads on these ones. And I didn't put many of these. I just put two. Two big ones. One up here. Mm -hmm. One down here. Apparently, Vicky did the video and she supplied the ribbon. Oh. She whipped out a piece of red satin ribbon. It was like the sketch out of Sister Act where she pulls out the gaffer tape. <laughs> it was very funny. It was very funny. It was good fun. It was a, that was a good DT meter. Very good fun. We need to okay. book our tickets for this year. We do. We do. Anybody come in the NEC? Because mm. we want to go. I'm just going to snip It's going to have to be on the Saturday. It's going to have to be on the Saturday, I think, yeah. Yeah. Did your laces catch fire or did you lick the marshmallow <laughs> off of the laces if it was under three seconds? <laughs> Could you imagine trying to undo those laces? Oh, that's what I was thinking. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. Yeah, that's not good. Crafty Lady Burger said that she purposely lights her marshmallows on fire. She likes the burnt outside, the yeah. inside. Yeah. Me too. It's like when you creme brulee, a cre when you, sorry, brulee a creme brulee. It has to be that little bit overdone to kind of counteract the sweetness nice. of the creme. 
You want your brulee to be really brulee. Brulee. A good bit of brulee. Okay, so we've got foam pads on all of the little marshmallows as well. Oh, it's set up like cement in her laces. Oh, oh no! At that point, her <laughs> laces can't be I was going to say, <laughs> just, just bin them, let's be fair. Cut yourself out of your boots at that point. Yeah. So just layer these wherever you want them. Cut more, cut less. Do whatever you want with your marshmallows. I've just laid a couple up here and there. I've got a couple over this side, I think. Little friends. Yeah, finishing the space. You know I'm not very good with... White space. No. No. Big space. Any space, really. Blank space. Blank space. I'll write your name. No, you didn't do. You drops. drops. No, I'm leaving that till the end. <gasps> You're being brave doing oh, drop I know. an angle. Ah. If I, maybe eat if I could find the drops. I didn't. I didn't bring one down in the kit box. Yeah, I know, but I wasn't going to open any one. Uh, it's fine. It's not in its plastic bags. So oh no! So we can't go back. Anyway. Okay. I probably did use this one actually. Right. Let's do some drops. Oh, okay. Oh, should we make sure the drops are working first? There are a few beers involved. I woke up the next day to sticky shoes in a car thirty feet away, mooing. <laughs> <laughs> Right, what I've done is I've looked at the pattern and I've gone for all these dots in the pattern. So I'm going to start up here and I'm going to go one there, one there, one in the centre of the flower. It's going to be nice and big in the centre of the flower because there's a fall there. Mm -hmm. Okay, where else have I gone? Down here, there's a drop there, there's one there, and that's there, and there. Um. Is that it? Oh, I have done the one inside of night. Oh, am I going to get him now? Yes, look at that. Look at you being brave, just picking up your wet ah, drops. Jeepers. Don't worry about it. It's only dropping it. Okay, and in this pattern, where have I gone? Oh, I remember doing this now. So I dropped this whole thing mm -hmm. before I glued it together. And then I went to stick this on and it wouldn't glue. I just flick all the drops off. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, dear. It wasn't oh, dear as well. Let's put one there. Oh, Kathy is planning on going to NEC. Oh, nice. nice. See, I'm pretty sure it will be the Saturday. Hold on, let me just... Yeah, I think it'll have to be the Saturday, to be honest. We're going to the centre of that snowflake what? there. Centre of that snowflake there. Oh, oh no. Is that going to be the 4th of November? Yep. Yeah. Sounds good. Yes, I don't have anything there in the end of that day. There we go. Well, sold. Uh, Mary Pankra said that she likes toasting marshmallow peeps. Uh, <gasps> people didn't know what peeps were. I know what peeps are. Um, yeah. You didn't know what peeps were. <laughs> <Sorry>. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, not real people. <laughs> not real peeps. No. I did buy marshmallow peeps. There was a, a shop, because we don't get those in the UK, uh, but there was a shop in Neath, uh, an American sweet shop. Is it still there? Has it gone? Mm. Oh, I don't know. I was I hoping it was still there. While. There is one, well, there was one last time I went into town. There was one in town. Oh, no, JK, J, JK Suites or something. Yeah, they've gone. Near the post office? Yeah, it's gone. Oh, wow, really, already? Yeah, oh, it's gone ages ago. All right, let's follow this dot around here. So we need two there. And another two here. I love my drops. Drapage? Don't get to use them enough these days, I don't think personally no. it's always because mark has cheated us for our work we don't have time for drops <laughs> so we dry. don't have time for drops when i was the memory book he was like can i have it now i was like no the drops aren't right yeah and then he went and dropped it he did. literally dropped the yeah, book my lovely memory book he was flicking through it but he was being really weird about it and then dropped the whole thing <laughs> yeah. So I think I am finished. Beautiful. I love it. And it's almost the same. I actually prefer the background mm. on this one. And I I've like done it. the thin ribbon on this one and the thick ribbon on my sample one. And there we have it. Two almost the same. Almost. I know. Very I know. Well I'm done. so I know I'm looking at it thinking I'm bound to have done something wrong because this is me. No, if you yeah. wanted to hang it up, I guess you could sandwich a bit of ribbon. Oh, definitely. Or even with, it's not with this, but we've done some 
oh, what was it on? What was it on? Think, think, think. Um, we did a small shadow frame that had some hanging holes. It was a, a die that cut like a triangle and you had a hole in it. So you had a glue tab on the triangle, the bottom right. of the triangle. Yeah. And then you had hanging holes. Vicky will know. Vicky will know where it was. Vicky, Vicky, tell me where that die was. <laughs> Vicky's got all of our dies. Yeah. So yeah, true. we've we've done so many sets, but we've done some things that were sort of purposely wall hanging type things, and they've had little dies that would cut a little piece that you can you can Stick put that on up. the back. But any of the closures from our boxes, they all have a little hole in them, don't they? They do. And you could glue those to the back. Yeah, that would work too. So yeah, so that is my craft along for this month. Well done. Thank you. I'm very impressed. That I didn't it. kill anything. Yes, for me. <laughs> so this was done using kit number 71, yes. which is Marshmallow Hugs. Oh, I'm going to change my glasses so I can see. Uh, oh dear, Moe's just ripped glue off the back of her hand. <laughs> Vicky says it was a slim shadow frame set. Yes, it was. It was. Nice one, Vicky. See, Vicky I knew always Vicky knows. would know. Vicky always knows. Mm -hmm. um, so... Cam or Blake, someone has put a link to the cam. Okay, I'm sorry, I have to credit the boys appropriately and they just get very sad. They do. Yeah, they miss the attention. So if you want to get this kit, it is still available? Yes. Still it available. Is. It is not yet the 18th? It is not. So if you want to get this kit, you have until the end of the day on the 18th. God, we're early this month, I aren't know, we? we are. But it would have been too late to do it next Tuesday. Yeah, That's it what it is. It would have been the 19th. The 19th. So that would have been too mm -hmm. late. Exactly. So you can still get this kit. Mm -hmm. If you want to buy it as a one-off, um, in the UK, that's going to be £34.99 for you. In the US, it's $39.99. If you want to subscribe to your kit, now don't forget, we've already talked about all the benefits. You mm -hmm. get your TCK 10% discount on the rest of the store. You get your um, little... Uh... Little what now? Oh, my goodness. Little what now? <laughs> Now you've made it really go out of my head. So every now and again, we'll do um, oh, right. subscriber-specific uh -huh. extra discounts. <laughs> um, you'll often get bonuses and benefits mm -hmm. in the kit boxes as well we on do. top. Um, so a monthly subscription in the UK is £29.99. In the US, it's $32.99. Or you can subscribe and pay quarterly, which is £89.97 in the UK and $97.97 in the US. And then I fall apart. Just every now and then, though. Um, I was sent two Kit 70s last month. Ooh. Oh, nice. Bonus. Yeah, if you buy a one-off kit now, or if you subscribe now, it will be this kit that you get first mm -hmm. of all. And then if you subscribe to a kit after your first payment, which I presume goes out straight away, Cam, just to nod if that's correct. Uh, how what? So if you were to subscribe to the kit now, <laughs> yeah. I presume you pay now and this kit gets sent yeah. to you, and then your next pay on the first. Yes. Is that right? Yes. So if you get it now, then, yeah, your payment will come out, your kit will go out, before the 18th and then your next payment will be the 1st of October for the next kit. Yes, there we go. So this gets sent out when? Immediately. Immediately. Oh, because it's yes. already... Oh, so yes, of course, of course. Purchase, sorry, sorry, sorry. I'm, I'm, I've got it now. Yeah. I've got you now. So if you purchase the new kit, so it's able to release the new kit mm -hmm. for the October one, um, your payment will come out before the 1st mm -hmm. if you're the first time buying it. Um, but it will get sent out until all the first. God, yeah. The first time you subscribe, you after, pay immediately, yeah. and then following that. Yeah, and then mm -hmm. any kit after the first will then just be sent out yeah. whenever you purchase God, it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Understood. I hope that made sense to you. So yes, basically you can still get this. You can still subscribe. You will get this kit if you subscribe and then you will immediately get the next one. Pint of lager for Cam. Risky. Wouldn't recommend. <laughs> Why are we talking about little black books, Mo? I mean, that's Al. That's nothing to do with us. That's all Al. Al is on the little black book. That's <laughs> so funny. Can't cardamom coffee for Blake? Really? Okay. I mean, I like cardamom. Mm. Oh, cardamom in rice pudding is delicious. Lovely. Um, everyone is loving the tutorial. Oh, Thank you very much. Good, 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 good. Now, don't forget, we want to see what you've done with this. Mm -hmm. Please Especially do. you, Mo. I want to see what you do with the frame. 
I'm curious now, you have piqued my curiosity. So if you have followed along or if you've decided to wait until we've finished mm -hmm. and then replay which is probably the safer option yeah i to think so um yeah we want to see what you've done so you can either post those pictures in our facebook groups that's the tonic studios official facebook group mm -hmm. funnily enough that's on facebook or on the rest of social media we are at tonic studios and you can use the hashtag show tonic to show us what you have done I cannot believe it's almost October. Basing my life on Tonic Studios lives makes life much fun. <laughs> I mean, you should try working on things that are coming out in six oh. months' time. We're currently thinking about December. Yeah, yeah, we're working on December at the moment. So that is just... This is why I never know where I am. I no. never know what date it is. I I have Everything to have... Flashes I have to have the day and the date on my watch. I have to, have to have the day. Yes. Because I don't know where I am. Absolutely no idea. No idea. Apparently, spellbinders have hiking boot dyes this month. So <laughs> Neva, I think, is going to combine those with some marshmallows and recreate that scene. I can't wait to see that. <laughs> I'd love to have something like that, oh, something fun like that. I, I would love to so see that. Fun. I would love to see that. I just posted a card. Thank you very much, Melissa. We'll go into oh, the when we get lovely. back upstairs. What else do I need to tell you? Hmm, so we've already talked about kit subscribers. Get uh -huh. that. You can get this now. Uh -huh. Any makes you've done. If you've enjoyed uh -huh. this, if you would like to see Karen do all of the makeup <laughs> from now on, oh, no. make sure you give us a thumbs up. <laughs> give us a little love heart on Facebook if you like. Oh, cute. Um, yeah, if you ever need to. <laughs> oh, don't. My dad's one couldn't do the heart. I didn't think he used to do this. <laughs> Very funny. Tacos. What? Tacos. <laughs> What's going on? We do. Oh, right. Okay. We do have um, a Taco Bell in Swansea now. We do, yeah. Mm. If you're vegetarian, though, it's quite disappointing. Yeah. yeah. It's not for me either. Yeah. Exactly. Exactly. What was I saying? I've forgotten now. Yes. If you liked this, like the video. If you're on YouTube, make sure you subscribe to our channel. If you're on Twitch, make sure you're following us. If you're on Facebook, well, you're already there. So you're good. <laughs> <laughs> oh it's all gone guys it's all gone if i've lost the words you know we're in trouble <laughs> make sure you hit that notification boomed ding okay go ahead go ahead make sure you hit that notification bell ding <laughs> So you'll be notified every time we post a new video <laughs> or when we go live so that you don't miss any of this, this. amazing content. Why would you You're want to? You're welcome, Cassie. I'm glad you have stuck with us for this. Well done. I hope you have enjoyed. <laughs> Thank you, everyone, for joining us. It has been wonderful to have your company here with us today. Cam, are you ready? Yes. I'm okay, ready. perfect. We'll see you all again very soon. Happy crafting. Happy crafting. <laughs>